my name is Fidel Moreno, and uh, I'm with Healing Winds. It's a Native American educational cultural organization, nonprofit, and uh, we are bringing Joseph Firecrow, who's a Grammy award-winning flautist, and he's Northern Cheyenne. And he and his wife are an incredible couple. Joseph travels throughout uh, the country and um, performs. He's a, an incredible uh, storyteller, singer, flautist, and he's here at Center Congregational Church in Brattleboro uh, for our fundraising capital uh, campaign to create the White Eagle Sanctuary and uh, a Native American Interpretive Center and a Center for Sacred Activism. Center are going to be in New England? We know, we've identified some land on Route 7 just uh, south of Williamstown, mm -hmm. um, right on Route 7. But we also are looking in the Brattleboro area, so if anybody from the Brattleboro area knows of land, 20 to 50 acres, we found 200 acres in, on Route 7, which is a main artery of tourism, you know, right. from Connecticut, Matt, through Mass, through New York, and up right. into Vermont, and over into Canada. Uh, we would like to um, be somewhere between, you know, Williamstown and Brattleboro. I'm a Northern Cheyenne uh, from the tribe. Uh, my name is Joseph Firecrow. Uh, I'm a flute man. I, make, I play flutes. Mm -hmm. I'm a singer and a drummer. And uh, the, the songs that we'll be doing tonight are the wolf songs from the people. Social songs. Mm -hmm. Songs of love. You are a Grammy Award winner too, which yes, is yes. excellent. It's, uh, it's just awesome to be uh, playing music and, and, and spreading a good word with uh, the native music. Yes, it is. We will take tobacco and we will offer it to Nishkina and to the tree. May I use you in a good way? We will ask. We are paying respect for ourselves and to everything around us, from Creator to the earth. And we will use all the tree. The roots we may carve things from, we may need a spoon, we need a bowl, something we can use. We are looking for the very center of the tree, the heart of it. We will split it into two pieces, and like a canoe, we will carve it out, and then we'll go back together, sealed with the life's blood. We will use sinew to bind the flutes. From the inside out is how we get the flutes. The most beautiful part of your flute comes from the inner, not how it looks on the outside. The inside is like this. It will vibrate, and that will give you this whole beautiful sound. And the songs are simple, and they come from the heart.
beautiful beauty of the soul flute. Now you're going to hear two flutes in one. Your heart chosen. Just sitting sit there just doing nothing. And here it was. And I'm telling you, I decided, yeah, humble. Humble your heart. Give it the gift that the Creator gave you. Look through that. And play it. responsibility and, and I'm grateful. It's hard. Uh, if it wasn't, it would be worth it. And again, I think Creator gave us this life so we can make us strong as human beings. And that's spiritual. When you have that, it's physical. It's a big one. 
and there's a very diverse amount of people here. You know, without just, if it wasn't for how this country was made, you know, we wouldn't be here. We wouldn't have the freedoms that we do. We must abide by the laws of the land, hold true to decency and dignity. And in times of hard, it's those things that will give us our strength. We'll pray for the spirit to go away. Maybe a song can bring it back. Remember where you come from. Remember what you know. Be honest with it. Be diligent about it. You can't get things back. Well, Mr. Nakai, my name is Joseph Firecourt, and it's an honor to meet you. And he said, what was your name? And I repeated it. And he turned his wife and he said, this is Joseph Firecourt. <laughs> An honest mistake. And she says, no, fire. And she, she, she heard me, but she, they, they heard of us. And just, it was awesome to be standing there talking to this man. Because he's such an inspiration to all of us, but us as native musicians. And there was others before him, but he got a lot of, uh, a lot of notes. And he's very, very, very good. To be standing there and I've been to the Grammy Awards a few times, and we need to meet. Whenever we go to major uh, world, world stages like Madison Square Garden or Kennedy Center, I'll see him there, and then we, we, we talk. And it's just like we have a, just like we just saw each other yesterday. I, I learned his song, and I didn't even know it was his. This, to me, is the most beautiful song ever I've ever heard. Of. And the name of the song is Wicker Wheel. And when I learned it, it was I, someone gave me a cassette. And the coverage was all tore off. So I didn't know who the artist was. But this one, this song stood out of all of them for me. It was beautiful. I, I loved it so much that I learned it. And whenever I would play it, I would ask people, if you know who this person's song is, if you know who the author is, let me know, because I wish to give RC.
We are.